in this next few minutes, I will show you what exactly is the Apple Pay, how this works, and how we can usually make some fast payments. So, Apple Pay is a secure, easy to use digital wallet that lets you make contactless payments in store, online, and within apps. You can also store loyalty cards, you can store tickets, and even boarding passes in the wallet application. Everything you need in just one place. Now you might be wondering how can I use this into any local space. So to get started with the Apple Pay, you can open the wallet on your iPhone and tap the plus sign to add a new credit or your debit card. Like it appears in here, for example. So it must be asking you, of course, to set up in seconds right into your phone. It must be asking you to add all the number information, the expiration date, and a CWB file, or let's say number, security code. So then you might be seeing that here it should be appearing the option that says Apple Pay and here is appearing the credit card or the debit card added here. So you can just uh, double click to pay and of course this recipient from Apple Pay should be sent automatically into your banking account. Now here, for example, uh, something else that you can do directly here is that you have the protection and personal data. So when you make a purchase, the Apple Pay can help you, of course, to use this device and just a unique transaction code. So your card number is never stored on any device or of the Apple servers, and when you pay, your card numbers are never shared by Apple with merchants. So this is, for example, like a virtual wallet, you might be saying such as that. You have, for example, the touchless, which you can just double click directly into your phone and just appear at the terminal. Um, and you can just make the payment without having to look out for a credit debit card to put it into a terminal. It's just using your phone if this one has the contact list option. Now, something else that you can do, uh, just check it out, of course, the Apple Pay, Apple Pay section of the Apple.com. So you have, for example, the wallet, where you can take it out and carry it on absolutely into anything. Into the wallet, as I just told you, you can add uh, driver's licenses, you can add tickets, you can add loyalty cards, and here you can check out that here you can add the Apple Cash or the Apple Wallet. So usually this one, of course, is gonna be helping us to make payments, you can receive rewards, you can pay anywhere, and adding a credit or a debit card with no added effort is really, really simple to do. So as you can see, you can see uh, a simple tutorial how we can add a card here. Uh, this video course generated by Apple. And as you can see, as I just told you, it's gonna be really, really easy. You can press the plus button, you can tap to the card, you can use your uh, camera to locate your own number so you can just add them manually. And once you have just added them, automatically uh, this card should be added into my Apple Pay. And when you double clicked into the right section of your Apple, you might see that you have here this element of uh, accept or confirm the payment method. Every terminal that has this contact list button or element seems that you can be making the payment with the Apple Pay. Now, this is something that is not available into all the countries, but there's something called the Apple Cash. We can send cash with text or just a tap where you can just send your money from one contact into another. This is, for example, if you have a specific iPhone or if you have a specific iOS. So this is totally painting where you're currently living. If this one is available, of course, into your country and if you have a credit or debit card that is available for it. So. Uh, something else that I can of course to use is the payment options. So you can pay in full or you can pay later for all the ways that you pay. Once again, this is depending on the country you are currently living. The Apple Pay also makes it easier to send money to friends as I just told you, but it uses advanced security features to protect our transactions. So our actual account numbers aren't shut. The Apple Pay uses a unique device account number and tokenization to keep your payment secure. Plus, every transaction requires a biometric authentication ensuring that only you can approve the payment so uh, you might be wondering where you can use the Apple Pay well the Apple Pay of course includes top stores there's Target there's Starbucks there's a Best Buy as well as an online platform like Etsy you can use it into apps like Uber uh, so just look for the contact list symbol for the Apple Pay options when you are checking this out and you might be using your phone for making the simplicity of the Apple using your credit card so the Apple Pay makes it really fast and payments more secure. Incredible convenient guys. If you find this video helpful, 
please don't forget to like share and subscribe to the channel there's a lot of things to cover into payment digital payment for example there's google pay there is splash there is clash there's now apple wallet apple pay and so much more so thank you once again guys hopefully this was really useful for you see you next time